Hello friend, welcome back to Autoresource YouTube channel. I have here today in my shop 2005 Subaru Outback and it came for initial inspection but the owner also said she had check engine light on. However, she came today and the engine light was off. So what I did, I used my scanner, right? Got underneath the dashboard, there is connector underneath there for a scanner. And the scanner told me that there is store code and it was P0301, which is misfire on number one cylinder. So what could cause misfire on number one cylinder right well that could be a bad fuel here are the fuel injectors right or it could be spark plug cable or spark plug itself so looking on this ej25 where is the number one cylinder look they are nicely even marked here you don't need to remember it one two three and four cables to the cylinders so obviously there are these cables right coming from the coil to the cylinders so regarding to that number one cylinder is this one so i pulled that cord right I disconnected it right here as you see right so i disconnected from there and pulled it from down there from the spark plug so here is my multimeter right and if i put it in the ohms which means resistance measuring resistance if i there is open right ol open hopefully you can see it and when i just test that i put these contacts together i have basically almost zero ohms right it's a six ohms only so now i can finally measure if this spark plug cable right this electric cable this wire if it's okay so i will touch inside there are these steel connectors this one is for the coil and the other one is touching spark plug and there needs to be continuity right so I touch it right here and I can see inside again that steel part and I'm touching it and look there's nothing changing there is fully open no matter how I touch that steel part in either end right I'm trying it there's completely OL which means open circuit so this spark plug cable is broken there's no continuity between these two ends. I pulled the other one from regarding to this from the number three, right? Just to compare it. So let's see what will happen if my multimeter is broken or it's the cable, right? This other cable, spark plug cable will give us the answer. So I'm touching the steel inside I can even click it there this way and click it here. So electric connectors, the steel connectors are touching and let me show you. So good cable has 9.9 .9 kilo ohms. This is the resistance of this cable on a number three cylinder. So we see this wire, it's not broken it's connected and this one will not cause the misfire on the cylinder number three ready let's for comparison pull this one from the place number two on the coil right so let's pull this cable carefully now you can see how i do that right i have to make space here to pop it off from the spark plug which is down there Boom it's off right so i have the number two cable and let's see together what will be the resistance this is really hot because the engine is 
still hot so don't burn yourself if you do the same click click and let's see you will see by yourself right what is the reading so again the steel parts boom I'm touching it and boom excuse me okay now I will maybe hold it okay so I will hold it and what is it 9.6 kilo ohms right so we have comparison that's the number which we supposed to see there is continuity the resistance it's within these numbers but we know that that number one cable is definitely bad as you can see in this video some troubleshooting and diagnosis can be pretty quick I hope you find this video interesting hopefully helpful and please make sure you are subscribed I will always have a lot of videos coming your way soon thanks for watching and have a nice day